start by copying the most recent version of master branch and paste it because it's master branch we know all the test cases are passing and rename it to the new name of the new cleaner open it up in your ide adam open the editme.js file and update the business name to the new name of the new dry cleaner compress it into the name of the dry cleaner this name needs to be the same name as the dry cleaner so that it's identified in our s3 bucket in aws Head to AWS, open the S3 bucket for our dry cleaners, and upload the zip file you just created of the dry cleaner code. It'll upload, copy the link that it creates for the dry cleaner, and we'll now go into Lambda to add it to our existing Lambda function. If you don't already have a Lambda function set up, just create one for Node.js. Um, switch the code entry type to S3 bucket and paste the S3 link. Once it's saved, we'll create a test case. Um, search for Alexa start session. Type the name as launch event and then we'll run this. This is going to be the same as a regular customer launching our app. Now for the front end, we'll need to create a skill. So create the skill and we will use the Jovo command line to build it. So go into your models ENUS folder paste the name of the dry cleaner and make sure that it's all lowercase. Go to your command line and run jovo build to generate the JSON file that you can drag and drop from Alexa skill models ENUS JSON into the editor, save and build the model. Go to endpoint and change it to AWS Lambda ARN. Copy your skill ID. Go to AWS Lambda and add a new AWS Alexa skills kit. Enter the skill ID we just copied, click add, scroll up to the top, save, and then copy the ARN number, including an up to ARN at the front. Paste that into our Alexa skill, save the endpoint, let's test it out. Enable testing and type in the invocation name we typed in our English US JSON model. We get hello, what's the name? Everything looks like it's working. I forgot to get the permission to get the full address. Make sure you go into permissions and enable full address. Now let's make sure that we get the prompt from asking for the address. Go into distribution and start copying the information from uh, my dry cleaner and pasting it in as the keywords, category, privacy, terms of use, short and long description. Be sure in the long description to update the invocation name that it says to the proper dry cleaning name or else Alexa will uh, decline they'll reject the app in the long description be sure to change that click save and continue uh, we do collect personal information we're collecting a phone number we do not target under the age of 13 it doesn't contain advertising and we export it jova frameworks the only testing instruction they need save and continue all's good on that page the validation test should run and pass so should the functional test and then we'll submit the skill and it is now ready for that new dry cleaner to be in review